everyone it's day six in china and we are heading to some water caves in this national park called longgong which means dragon's palace We're in an elevator that goes up to the top of the mountain. Dragon Palace, Wonggong. It's not over yet. Here we go again. Ooh, water drinking. My dad is waiting for me down there and right now I'm just climbing up to take a look at one Jia Cave. Nobody else is up here. <sighs> I'm so tired. Whoa, looks scary. Looks like somebody lives here. I'm afraid somebody's gonna pop out of nowhere and scare me. There's some little huts in the cave. Super spooky. Okay, I'm gonna leave and go head back down. Okay, well, that was interesting, but we're gonna head back. I'm trying to find the exit, but it's just so many stairs. I'm just climbing and climbing the mountains. walk to the exit and we go through the caves to do that it's so cold well it's not that cold it's chilly you can see I watch my step here Spiral staircase up there to the exit. Mm -hmm. 
Almost to the top. Yeah. <laughs> We just came out of the cave all the way from there. <laughs> We've made it to the other side of the cave. Also paying their respects here with incense. So it's very smoky and it smells very strong here. Here's another Buddha and lots of burning incense. I guess this is the last Buddha. It's the laughing Buddha. We're on our way back to the hotel now. That was very fun and exciting. My dad is gonna get some fruits over there. This is the fruit that we got from the lady by the street. Very sour. We're waiting at this tiny airport and we decided to get some twin twin wontons and some airport dumplings. Let's give it a try. Mm. Right now we're in an airport lounge in the Huangguoshu Airport. We are waiting for our 10.30 flight to Shenzhen. So that's it for day six in China. And I will see you tomorrow in a brand new city. Bye. Oh yeah, I also lost my little Canada hat that I've been wearing for the last few days and I'm actually kind of devastated. <laughs>